Welcome back to Flash Rock Live. You've got me, TFG. This millennia's answer to Keith Richards. Uh, this rock and roll lifestyle is killing me, but I wouldn't have it any other way. Otto's daughter.
Thank you, Wiata's daughter. Welcome back to Flash Rock Live, and you know, I always say this, but it's always true. You just got through listening to another blistering set, only this time from Otto's daughter. Introduce yourselves and tell them what you do in the band if they're blind. Okay. I'm Roman, I play bass. I'm Jim, I play guitar. I am Jacqueline, and I sing. Gilbert, drummer. And Kyle, guitar. Okay, so what I just showed you was their, this is what, your EP that you've got right here? Yeah. All right, so this is their EP. How about any new albums? What's coming up with that? The new album is in the making. Still it's going to be works. finished, yes. It's going to be finished, hopefully, um, by mid-March. We're shooting for that, yeah. Very it's cool. going to be called A New Kind of Heroin. Heroin. He loves how I say that. <laughs> I, I heard heroin. heroin. I was like, hey, I like that, too. <laughs> heroin. Heroin. Heroin, okay. Not the drug, but as in the, uh, the powerful woman. There you go. So I'm listening to the set, and I don't know why, but it's like while well, I'm, I'm watching you guys and listening to you, I just uh, for some reason like the ride of the Valkyries or that you know that part from Carmina Burana that everybody's so familiar with just like came to mind, and the power and everything that was behind you guys it was just it was it was awe inspiring to say the least. So now I was checking out your MySpace, which is where can they reach you on that? MySpace.com. That's your daughter. All right, cool. Mm -hmm. I was checking you guys out, but there's only four of you in the lineup as far as it goes. I know it's Kyle. Kyle, right? Kyle. Yeah. You're the newer guy, right? That's right. I've been doing some of our live stuff, playing the last couple of uh, live shows with him, filling in for him. Nice. Doing a great nice. job. Doing so he's just kind of like the, the uh, pinch hit guy, or is he like going to be part of the, the upcoming album, or how's that working? It's really up to Kyle. <laughs> right. I kind of saw it was the other way around. I thought it was up to you guys. <laughs> oh, okay. And I was on film. Right, well, I think you've got a, a moment there. All right, cool. Now, you've been here before um, with another band, Lock and Load. You've yeah, I was helping them out for a while. Uh, yeah, I came in here, had a great time with you guys. Very Back cool. again. Well, now you know, you're, It's always uh, fun. Well, thank you. We try to make it fun. You're now in the illustrious Two Timers Club as well. So. Uh, <laughs> nice. So very cool. Nice to be right, back. Well, tell me a little bit about the band. How did you guys get together? How did you all meet? I mean, like, what is it that made Otto's daughter Otto's daughter? Otto's daughter started in New York City a while ago. A while ago. <laughs> a long time ago. And um, it was really from goth, very goth, industrial, you know, hitting up the whole goth industrial scene on the East Coast pretty much. Um, developed into a more metal rock pop thing. Um, Jim is pretty much the only original member, like, not even like, yeah, the newest member, the oldest newest I'm member. the oldest newest <laughs> member. <laughs> the oldest newest member. I'm the um, guitar player. Yeah. Yeah, we've been through a lot of musicians. Um, he, he joined in 2001, actually, 9-11 is responsible for that. And um, we moved out here to California in uh, 2003, and that's when nice. we actually met Roman and Gilbert almost at the same time, almost. We met Gilbert a little bit later. Within three weeks. Within three weeks, yeah. Um, just, you know, I think MySpace, actually, a friend of his, yeah. yeah, it was really cool, <laughs> you know. Jim used to give me so much shit for MySpace, and, you know, it turned out to be a really great tool for us. Exactly. And so, this band has been, this lineup has been together since, um, what, like about a year? Five, Five. since early 2005? Yeah. <laughs> Mid 2005. And <laughs> that's when really things started to pick up for us, you know. It's like the right combination of people now, the right, you know, we got our everything pretty much together now it's the chemistry is awesome and yeah the live show has really picked up from you know people that know us from seven five seven years ago you so know? the following is is growing yeah constantly. and also the sound has evolved like really to like a nice thick metal I noticed Rock that metal. some of the other stuff that I noticed on uh, on your page, and then I guess you've got another page, is a little bit more dance, electric oriented stuff. You know, it's really, really cool album. stuff in itself. But yeah. uh, you know, you guys came in here and you, you definitely rocked it. You know, the rafters. You know, we're rattling back there. There's mm. been a few bands that have come in here and done that, but you guys definitely rank in that one. So oh, thank you. Nice. Cool. But like I, like I was saying earlier, I mean, I just I felt the energy and just the raw. I don't know, I don't really want to call it aggression, but I guess it is a, an aggression of sort. You're getting that yeah. out, so you know yeah. I. I I would expect everybody out there felt it as well, you know. All right, at this point, I'd like to give you guys a chance to say anything that you've got on your mind, whatever it be, relevant, irrelevant. It doesn't really matter because you've heard the stuff I spew out, so now's your moment. <laughs> <laughs> we have a sound guy named Curtis Priest. That is his real name. And um, we, we got him about three months ago. And he, an awesome he isn't job. here right now. Yeah, he yeah. is just as integral in our sound, live, as anything. He's he's essentially like the, the sixth member and he's ex he's just as important as everybody here with the exception of Jacqueline 
because he knows our sound, he knows how to set our sound, and he is directly responsible for how good we sound live. So yeah. we gotta give shout out big, to Curtis. Yeah, big, yeah. Big, yeah. Big rocks. All right, so you young and upcoming bands out there, remember what they just said because it's so true. I mean, a band is the members that play the instruments, but without a good sound man, you know, you're only as good as you can pull it off. You've got to have a good sound man, as these people right. obviously are aware of. All right, once again, this is their EP, and they can get this where? On uh, myspace.com, Dash Otto's Daughter, on ottosdaughter.com, CD Baby. All the shows. All the shows. Come to the live shows. That's really... Uh, it, Otto's Daughter is one thing, you, you listen to the music on CD, but then you come to the show and you experience us live, and it's really a whole nother experience. Because oh, we, like we like to not just play a show and then go home, we, we hang out with our, we, we call them the friends, you know, not really fans, friends, friends, fans, and um, most of them are really becoming part of the family, and which is really cool. Like, we really appreciate everything that our people do for us, coming to the shows, buying CDs, you know. Hanging out. Without you, you, we would be nothing. And That's right. what I would like to say is to a lot of bands out there, you just got to keep going. You know, like it's really, from my experience, I've been in, with Otto's Daughter from the very beginning. And uh, I've gone through so many musicians. And one thing that I always said to myself is, I don't care. I'll give, I'm not going to give up. I'm going to keep playing. I'm going to keep finding better musicians, new musicians. It's just very, you don't give up. Hopefully this is it. You know, <laughs> 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 yeah. odds, are, <laughs> odds are that this might be it. Because you see so many talented musicians, they just like quit because right. they couldn't either get signed and discipline. Get, it's a it's a great thing to get signed and get the money. Obviously, everybody wants that. I want that, you know. But the, going on stage and doing your thing, mm -hmm. living your dream and being who you really <laughs> are, your essence. That's the most important part. And do whatever makes you happy, you know. And don't. All the other things will eventually come. There you go. I, I believe in that. On a side note, really. on a side note, if you're doing this for the money, get out. Get out. Get out now. <laughs> it's not here. Yeah, yeah. 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 Give it to us. The money. <laughs> get out. Get out now. You see the world lifestyle I'm living. I mean, hell. <laughs> 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 so I mean, again, like she, like she said, you, you got to stick it out. You know, obviously, yeah, this looks like looks like the lineup to me because there was a unit up there. There wasn't an individual player. There, you know, it was Otto's daughter up there slamming it out. You guys were doing your thing. Uh, you know, and again, you know, how can you quit if you know this is what you're doing? This is your life. I mean, you might as well just kill yourself. Exactly. Basically, just kill yourself. You have nothing to live for. <laughs> Do the world a favor. <laughs> yeah, that's very uplifting. <laughs> no, you guys are uplifting. I mean, you're a good example of a band that's out there that's been, you said, been going for about the last seven years, you know, trying to make it, and it's it's growing. I mean, you can't just do it overnight, as, as any of the bands that have been out there doing it will tell you, and as they just said. So they can reach you on the MySpace, you, and you have a, a website, too? That was yeah, mm -hmm. autosdaughter.com. It's O-T-T-O-S-D-A-U-G-H-T-R. Autosdaughter. Autosdaughter. All right, well, thank you very much, Otto's daughter, for coming in and just blowing the doors off this place again. Uh, we are very happy to have you here. Flashrock.com is always ready to accommodate any independent and unsigned band that wants to come in here and do a webcast. We'll even play your stuff on the radio show. The only catch is, is you've got to be a registered member, and that's absolutely free. So, I mean, you can take like five minutes out of your day, you know, aside from all the porn you're surfing, <laughs> upload your three MP3s, pictures in a bio, yeah, okay? Roman. You can even call us up on the radio show, which is Monday nights at this point from 7 to 11 Pacific. Pacific Standard Time, 818-503-1404, and go, hey, you snarly-ass bastards, play my music, and we will. All right, Otto's Daughter is another fine example of some of the local and independent talent that we've got in here. Your hair's so. melting. It does that. <laughs> and if we keep them in the lights too long, their hair will melt. So thanks for tuning in to FlashRock.com. This is that fucking guy here with Otto's Daughter. Woo! Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Hey. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I wanted thank to thank you. Peter. I forgot thank to thank Peter. Oh, thank shit. You. We didn't get Thanks to thank Peter. Pleasure, man. It's yeah. been great to have you guys. Oh, uh, right, get the fuck out. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. no. <laughs> this, there's no way you can. There's no way to say anything, right? Shit. Thank you.
Welcome back to Flash Rock Live. You've got me, TFG. This millennia's answer to Keith Richards. Uh, this rock and roll lifestyle is killing me, but I wouldn't have it any other way. Otto's daughter. Closer and it's got to break 